Spectacular performance by Mauricio Shogun Hua. Boss, there's the younger brother of Ninja, Mauricio Shogun Hua, weighing in at 204 pounds. Over there, momentarily for Mauricio Shogun. But he's not going to A big kick over on the knee. Oh, that one hit. The left one hit. And the right one hit. The flight of strong Jindo. Oh. Oh. And the knee. Shoot knee up to the head. Oh, left group for him. Just oh, amazing shot, and he oh, finally goes oh. down on the canvas. It's Akira Shoji. And it is over. Oh, Shogun did it. It's just Shogun. Winner, Mirko. Mauricio Shogun is 23, 5, 10, 205 pounds, an unblemished record in pride at 4 and 0. Oh. And we are almost. Getting ready here, final instructions. The referee calls for the bell, and Phil and Boss, this should be a war. Wow. He came yeah, out he came hard. through a hard one, too. Yep. A hard one, too. You, they, they, they're trying not to lose rather than to win. There's so much at stake. They're trying so hard to, 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 oh. to, to, to not lose. Big See? knee by Shogun. And Shogun is just going for it. That's the difference right here. Man, I think Rampage might be hurt to the body or something. He's, yeah, he's hurt to the body. Yep. He's hurt to the body. Shogun recognizes and goes for the kill with a, with, a, with a big left hook to the liver. Yeah, his rib is hurt, man. I saw it. He's got to just go for it, man. He's got to throw. He's got to let his hand oh, go. Oh, an uppercut hurt. Uh, not good, not uh, good. Man, they, they, they say, man, there's a thing that says when you get knocked out once, it's easy to get knocked Boy, out each time. time. Master Shogun absolutely decimating Quentin Rampage Jackson in this, the first round. The youngest competitor is really taking it to the Pride veteran. You know, you see Quentin, he's, he's got a heart of a lion, will not go down, but this is not good. This is not good. Yeah, this is the end of the fight. Oh! Mauricio Shogun has just electrified the crowd and perhaps shocked many MMA fans. Sh shock me, Shogun shock me. Shogun's for real. Beat. Shogun's for real and he has arrived. Man, there's no American to the tournament. I can't, I can't believe it. You know, we shut the door on that right there. Mauricio Shogun! Mauricio Shogun is 23-6-1, 205 pounds, 7-0 in pride, on the cusp of enjoying his biggest night ever, for that matter, also for Mauricio Shogun, and what an artistic spinning kick that was. Beautiful here. Now she what, look at this. Hey, Uma Plata. Plata. He's got it? Does he have? No, it slips out, I think. No, it's still there. Right off the bat. Oh, no, he's out. Whoa, would uh, that be something? And looking for the knee right this. away, and a stop kick. Uh-oh, to the grudge. This Mauricio Shogun, 23 years of age, undefeated at 7-0. You talk about a supernova. Look at this, it's over! It's over! Unbelievable! I don't think I've ever seen a more dominating performance in my life, Boss Rutan. Oh, unbelievable. Look at this. The family is in the there. Fireworks at the Saitama Super Arena. And I think, really, next to Mauricio Shogun, the happiest man in the ring, and there he is, it's Vanderlei Silva. Oh, my God. Obey my command. Protect yourself at all times. Come out ready to fight. Hook him up. Good luck. Steve Mazzagatti in charge over Reem and Shogun, ready to go. This, this is where he wanted to put this fight because he knew that Overeem was going to beat him on the leg. Oh, great over him. Right coming down to the canvas. Hua gets his fight now where he wants it, on the canvas with Overeem on his back. But as you mentioned, Alistair very strong, trying to quell those punches. Picking his shots, landing rocks for the up kick again from Alistair, I'm sure. Hua's going to dive right in with another big punch. And look at him. That's it, that's it, that's it. Oh, my God. Hua jumped on the head. What an incredible overhand right. He jumped right into it, picked his hands apart, and dropped right into it. Right on the butt. With every ounce of muscle that Hua had, he wound up and delivered an overhand right that cleared 
everything that Overeem had in his mind. He went totally blank. The fight is over. That punch was not fast. It was sudden. He's ready to surprise, he says, Chuck Liddell with that stand-up that made him so popular upon his arrival into the UFC. Liddell might be trying to set up an uppercut. That right shoulder drop for a second. Liddell is down! Shogun trying to finish! And it is all over! Wow. Mauricio Shogun Hua has defeated Chuck Liddell! Chuck Liddell gets caught with the left, dropped, Shogun on top of him, hammer fist, and Chuck just trying to get up, but he's not defending himself. Mario Yamasaki looking at him and just decided that he had had enough. Here you see it again. The left hook drops him, and Shogun all over him. Hammer fist over and over again. Huge victory for Mauricio Shogun Hua. Mauricio Shogun Hua. He said more than anything in his life. So far, Joe, his fighting life, he cherishes the Pride Grand Prix title he won in 2005. It was a very difficult tournament. He beat top guys to win the title. Quentin Rampage Jackson, Little Nog, the Toro Noguera, Ricardo Arona. He thought in his mind he beat Lyoto Machida the first time. He knows in his mind that he wants to win here tonight, that he wants to finish Machida, not let the judges decide his fate. He wants to decide his own fate tonight. And that could all nice knee to the body. Let's take a look at it again. He lands a beautiful knee to the body. Shogun clips him with that one on the temple. Lands a few more, gets the full mount. And the lights go out in Georgia. He promised not to leave it up to the judges this time. And he delivers by knockout. Spectacular performance by Mauricio Shogun Hua. The uncrowned champion is now the champ. Mauricio Shogun Hua is the new UFC Light Heavyweight Champion. Shogun and Hendo. Non-title fight, but scheduled for five. Five-minute rounds. I think one of the keys to this fight for Shogun will be... Oh! Shogun takes Henderson down. Henderson's got a guillotine, he's got he's a front got choke. incredible strength, Joe. Can he choke him out? Can he get him from this position? He's got a front choke, and he hit him with a knee, and a big oh, punch. big shots. Shogun's in Shogun's big trouble. covering up. He's standing right in front of him. Henderson. Watch for the right hand again. Oh! Big shots by Hendo. Good start for Henderson. Uppercut by Shogun. Shogun finding his range. Got a shot in on Henderson, and he's looking for some ground and power. Henderson's holding on to a single, but he's getting tagged. Big right hand, uppercut. Huge uppercut. And a big left hook to the body. It's in the perfect place, that's for sure. Oh, oh big right hand. Trying to finish it right here. He's hurt. He's big hurt. shots. Henderson looking to finish the fight! Shogun's covering up, but he's hurt bad! One minute. Oh, vicious elbows by Dan. And Shogun has Dan down! And now Shogun pouring it on Henderson. But he's not firing it like he was earlier. Big shot by Shogun! Dan's in trouble! And he wants the takedown. Goes into that autopilot mode. Shogun's got out, he hit him with a shot. Oh! Henderson came right back with the stutter step. Takedown. Shogun with the takedown. And Dan just took a huge deep breath. 30 seconds. Full mount for Shogun. Shogun trying to finish it here. Henderson looking to survive. 
full mount on Henderson. This classic matchup that we've waited a lifetime for. Big shot by Ochoa has turned into one of the greatest fights in mixed martial arts history. All three judges score this contest 48, 47. Declare the winner by unanimous decision. Dan Henderson! Henderson does enough early to earn the decision victory tonight. The legend, Shogun Hua. Okay, the you're new right. kid you're on right. the block, go, the German. Australian, Tyson Pedro. He just manages to get through with elbows that count. We can see some damage to the bridge of the nose. What was that? I don't know. It, it was a limp as well. Yeah, it looked very unstable on that rear leg. Oh, that's, oh, good. Oh, so that's a knee leg. injury. That's He's absolutely a knee injury. Taking Shogun. big shots now. Fight back to the heavy Shogun. artillery from Shogun. The legend is looking to punch his way to victory. Pedro's covering him. Shogun Hua back in the wing column here in Adelaide. So you can see as Tyson Pedro puts his weight on his back leg, something gives out. I'm not sure whether it was a knee, I feel like it was a knee injury. His knee buckled, he dropped to the floor, and Shogun chased him for the finish. It was a good stoppage by the, by the referee. I don't think Tyson would have found his way back into that round. I certainly don't think he would have been able to get back to his feet, uh, uh, certainly not with, uh, with Shogun on top of him. That was a, a big win for Shogun, who came through some adversity in that first round, was able to weather an early storm put a good second round together. Yes, despite the injury to Pedro, Shogun Hua had to do the business.